According to Wikipedia, there are no wine-producing regions in Finland. Wait a second. Even Turkey produces wines. Wikipedia is wrong! 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 I know there's plenty of wines in Finland and this episode is about them. As I've mentioned before, Alko is the national alcoholic beverage retailing monopoly in Finland. If you want to buy any drink with more than 4.7% alcohol in Finland, you have to visit in Alko. This naturally means that it is the main wine store here too. Some wine enthusiasts outside of Finland have praised Alko for its comprehensive collection of imported wines. Despite that, the best-selling brands are Gin Londrink and, of course, Kosken Korvan Leijona Vodkas. Even though the Finns aren't that famous for drinking wine, it's not true to say that they don't drink it at all. For example, according to Alko statistics, Voldemar was very popular wine in 2010. Because of that, let's introduce it first. The real flavor and scent of raspberry and vermouth unite gently, making the perfect setting for the refreshing aftertaste. To respect this nobility, it should be served cold, between 2 or 6 Celsius. Preferably without any cheese or other food, because it would only weaken the exciting taste. Of course, some have a more critical opinion about it. For instance, on this webpage a Finnish reviewer says Valdemar potkii kuin Jari Litmanen, ihan hyvin vaikka kaikki tietää, että se on aivan paska. Which roughly translated means Valdemar kicks like Jari Litmanen quite well even though everyone knows that it's shit. But now we shall proceed. Another popular Finnish wine is Sobus, also called Soppa, soup, which is made of Sobus berries, naturally. Altia, a Finnish state-owned corporation which produces alcoholic drinks, recommends on their homepage Sobs for tasting, student parties and vappu. The latter one is the only carnival-style festivity in Finland. Yeah, believe it or not, but even the Finns have one day in a year when it's okay and socially accepted to be happy. And that day is the 1st of May. What the hell? Finland isn't in the list of wine producing countries, but the article about Sobus says the Finnish wine carries the same name. This is an outrageous error and has to be fixed immediately. Yes, what a shameful thing they did indeed. At least I still got two bottles left. I'll store them in my wine cellar to wait for a perfect day for tasting. And Erno will never get the key, so they keep stored for years. Even though Altia killed one of the most popular Finnish wines after 75 successful years, some products still remain to keep Finnish wine enthusiasts happy. So, let's proceed to the third and last wine, which has been proven to be the best Finnish wine I have ever encountered. Let's let Finnish wine enthusiast Jaska Tonkainen speak few words about this marvelous product. Today we are enjoying the full flavor of nice Kuopio wine. Its grapes have been grown in the sunny sides of Neulamäki hill. The true heart of Kuopio city and the nature which surrounds it in every direction. The 
color is nice and red. And the bottle, the design is quite extraordinary for wines. Okay, now is the time to taste this great product. And what do we say when we have a toast? Helegum, helegum.